We're here with Mike Gorgia and his 1975 Pontiac Brougham. Did I say that right? Yes. Okay. Tell me uh, a little bit about this car. Tell me about how you got it. Well, well, I used to work at Alpine Pontiac in Brooklyn years ago, and my boss's brother had the same car in all black, and I always loved the car. I always wanted one. A couple of years ago, two years ago to be exact, I found the car in Bronxville, New York on Craigslist. Talk to me a little bit about the condition, because I'm, as I'm looking at it, the condition is really good, and there's a lot of original detail. Yes, it's an excellent driver, a, a, a very close, you know, to like near pristine car, uh, but not quite. But it's um, original 40, not quite 48,000 mile car. It's evident by the condition of the interior that you could see, you know, it's low mileage car. When I bought the car, it had the original brakes in the car. It's a 400 engine with a four barrel carburetor. Um, unfortunately, in 1975, the cars were kind of detuned, so they don't have the power like the cars of the late 60s and early 70s. But it's a big enough engine to rocket this car down the road pretty good. You get a nice cruise with it. These tops from 1971 to 1976 with the Cadillac Eldorado was the last year of the uh, big convertibles. They have a scissor top. And the reason General Motors did this was to increase rear seat room. Speaking of room, I mean, can your Jeep fit in the trunk of this car? I could put two Jeeps in the trunk of this car. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what do you say we take a ride? Sure, let's go.